then for week three of SA3, we're doing um, our rhetorical device is verbs, okay? So we want to have strong verbs in our sentences. You guys have already done this in essentials, so this is easy. I have my students, you know, like on the week three, the, the elocution week, I have them come home Tuesday, add your rhetorical devices. So this is essay three. Not only are they adding a strong verb, but they're also adding a parallelism one, okay? So on Tuesday, they're gonna add their parallelism one, and they're gonna add their strong verb. Where do we want strong verb in here? Say that again. Changing what we have. Mm -hmm. Yes. I need to necessarily write verbs because it's kind of an outline, so we can just kind of add one in. But yes, anywhere in here. Hungry, famished. Yes. Uh -huh. um, although this would be like he was hungry, so hungry kind of be serving as an adjective. Um, was being the main verb that we're kind of using. Okay. What about we said he wanted treat desired. desired. <laughs> okay, so I would just tuck it right in there. So just like that is what I kind of tell my students to do. Just kind of mark it out. No, here's my strong verb. This is what I'm upgrading. Um, and uh, for my students, I will tell them, highlight that on your paper so I know that's your strong verb. Because verbs are kind of hard to tell. You know, if that was one you purposely worked for, I want to appreciate it for you. So there you go. So now they're going to write this whole thing into their essay. Hey teachers, thanks for popping in and watching this video. Um, if we haven't met before, hi, I'm Erica Lynn and I'm a homeschooling mom. I have four kids and I have been teaching them for over 10 years now. We use a classical approach to schooling, so I've been using my father's world and classical conversations. Um, it's my goal to help homeschooling become easy for you too. So I'm taking all the tips and tricks that I have learned over the years and I'm putting them here for you to see. So congratulations on making it to the end of the video. Would you just pop a hearts emoji into the comments so that I know you watched the whole thing. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. And be sure to subscribe and ring the bell. And if you liked this video about the LTW curriculum, you need to check here to see the next video in this series. You guys have a great day. And remember, you are already enough.